E aí galera, beleza? Eu sou o Nix e se você chegou até aqui é porque você curte games ou o conteúdo te agradou. Então não esqueça de deixar o seu like para ajudar na divulgação, se inscreva no canal e se você já for inscrito, ative o sino para a notificação e fique por dentro de todas as atualizações aqui no canal. Não esqueça também que na descrição do vídeo você encontra nossas páginas de divulgação e muita informação extra. Eu me despeço por aqui. E a gente se vê. I made a promise that I was done with this life. It's not what it looks like. E aí galera, beleza? Seja bem-vindo ao canal Next Games. Eu sou o Nix e no vídeo de hoje. A gente está seguindo aí com a nossa programação normal, estamos com o Mass Effect 3. Uh, e no vídeo anterior a gente conseguiu driblar aí aos poucos, né, nos 46 do segundo tempo, a gente conseguiu driblar uh, o Reaper e o Shepard conseguiu entrar na luz que está dando acesso à Citadel. Lembrando que a Citadel está fechada, então ela está em posse do Reaper e por isso olha a quantidade de corpos que a gente encontrou aqui. Shepard está... No fim da vida, ele está arrebentado, está muito mal. E a gente vai seguindo assim mesmo. Estamos sem armadura, sem escudo. E sem arma, só com essa pistolinha aí. Então a gente está seguindo aqui agora dentro da Citadel. E vamos ver o que nos espera no final desse caminho. Oh, Anderson? Olha, é muito corpo, tá vendo aqui? É muito corpo, realmente. E se eu não me engano, o Anderson ele tá aqui também, tá? Just found that chasm you were talking about. Hold on. I see something. A control panel, maybe. I'm just gonna go on. Parece que o Anderson ele tá um pouquinho à nossa frente. Ele já passou por aqui e chegou do painel. É onde nós estamos indo agora. Olha, se eu não estou enganado, esse vai ser o último vídeo de Mass Effect 3. survival control of the reapers and of you if necessary mm. they're controlling you i don't think so Adam. controlling me is a lot different than controlling a reaper have a little faith when humanity discovered the mass relay when we learned there was more to the galaxy than we imagined. There were some who thought the relay should be destroyed, 
They were scared of what we'd find, terrified of what we might let in. But look at what humanity has achieved. Since that discovery, we've advanced more than the past 10,000 years combined. And the Reapers will do the same for us again, a thousandfold. But... <sighs> Only if we can harness their ability to control. Bullshit. We destroy them. Or they destroy us. And waste this opportunity? Never. You're playing with things you don't understand. With power you shouldn't be able to use. I... don't believe that. If we can control it, why shouldn't it be ours? Because... we're not ready. No. This is the way humanity must evolve. There's always another way. I've dedicated my life to understanding the Reapers, and I know with certainty the Crucible will allow me to control them. <laughs> and then what? Look at the power they wield. Look at what they can do. I see what they did to you. I took what I wanted from them, made it my own. This isn't about me or you. It's about things so much bigger than all of us. He's wrong. Don't listen to him. And who will you listen to, Shepard? An old soldier stuck in his ways, only able to see the world down the barrel of a gun? And what if he's wrong? What if controlling the Reapers is the answer? If we destroy the Reapers, this ends today. But if you can't control them... But I can! Are you willing to bet humanity's existence on it? I... know it will work. You can't, can you? They won't let you do it. No! I'm in control! No one is telling me what to do! Listen to yourself! You're... indoctrinated! No! No! The two of you so self-righteous. Do you think power like this comes easy? There are sacrifices. You've sacrificed too much. Shepard, I... I only wanted to protect humanity. The Crucibles can control it. I know it can. I just... It's not too late. Let us go. We'll do the rest. I... Uh, I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own you now. You... You'd undo everything I've accomplished. I won't let that happen. You're not yourself anymore. We've taken you. Now! You're the one who failed! And you will die knowing you're one of my greatest disappointments. Bem, eu não queria dar pontos pro Renegade, mas não tem jeito, então eu vou é matar Illusive Man. A gente vai ter que ser ruim aqui no final, mas nada demais, a gente está com ponto de Paragon bem elevado. I can't do that, Commander. Of course you can't. They own me now. You... You'd undo everything I've accomplished. I won't let that happen. You're not yourself anymore. We've taken you. 
now you're the one who failed. Chega, Ilusive Man. Eu ia deixar você viver. Você não quis? A gente finaliza aí com a morte dele. Chega de Cerberus. Shepard então conseguiu abrir a Citadel. O Crucible vai se juntar a ela, formando a Arma Suprema para poder destruir o Reaper. I wish you could see it like I do, Shep. It's so perfect. Pô, isso tudo é perfeito. Olha só quanta destruição, cara. Que loucura. Ele realmente sempre foi um louco. Galera, momentos finais aí de Mass Effect. Commander? We did it. Yes, we did. It's uh, quite a view. <laughs> Best seats in the house. God. Feels like years since I just sat down. I think you earned a rest, Anderson. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Stay with me. We're almost through this. You did good, son. You did good. I'm proud of you. Thank you, sir. Anderson. É, Anderson, você tava com a gente aí desde o começo. Esse seu descanso é mais que merecido. Shepard, Commander. Hey. What do you need me to do? Nothing's happening. The crucible's not firing. It's gotta be something on your end. Commander Shepard. I don't see. I'm not sure how to. Commander.
gente ainda vai ter um pouquinho de diálogo antes de do fim chegar. Wake up. As partes que estão em inglês aqui do jogo eu vou estar traduzindo para a gente poder entender aí tudo direitinho. The Citadel, it's my home. Who are you? I am the Catalyst. I thought the Citadel was the Catalyst. No, the Citadel is part of me. I need to stop the Reapers. Do you know how I can do that? Perhaps. I control the Reapers. They are my solution. Solution? To what? Chaos. The created will always rebel against their creators. But we found a way to stop that from happening. A way to restore order. By wiping out organic life? No. We harvest advanced civilizations, leaving the younger ones alone. Just as we left your people alive the last time we were here. But you killed the rest. We helped them ascend, so they can make way for new life. Storing the old life in Reaper form. I think we'd rather keep our own form. No, you can't. Without us to stop it, synthetics would destroy all organics. We've created the cycle so that never happens. That's the solution. You said you're the catalyst. What are you? A construct. An intelligence designed eons ago to solve a problem. I was created to bring balance, to be the catalyst for peace between organics and synthetics. So you're just an AI? In as much as you are just an animal, I embody the collective intelligence of all Reapers. But you were created. Correct. By who? By ones who recognized that conflict would always arise between synthetics and organics. I was first created to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life, to establish a connection. But our efforts always ended in conflict, so a new solution was required. The Reapers? Precisely. I met your creators. They told me what you did to them. We did as we were expected. They said you betrayed them. That you turned them into Harbinger. When they asked that I solve the problem of conflict, they failed to understand they were part of the problem themselves. The flaws of their organic reasoning could not perceive this. They lacked the foresight to understand their destruction was part of the very solution they required. Well, they've joined this war now. And I welcome their involvement. I am only facilitating their request. Where did the Reapers come from? Did you create them? My creators gave them form. I gave them function. They, in turn, give me purpose. The Reapers are a synthetic representation of my creators. Leviathan. Yes. They created me to oversee the relations between synthetic and organic life. To establish a connection. They became the first true Reaper. They did not approve, but it was the only solution. You said that before. But how do the Reapers solve anything? Organics create synthetics to improve their own existence. But those improvements have limits. To exceed those limits, synthetics must be allowed to evolve. They must, by definition, surpass their creators. The result is conflict, destruction, chaos. It is inevitable. Reapers harvest all life, organic and synthetic, preserving them before they are forever lost to this conflict. But you're taking away our future. Without a future, we have no hope. 
without hope. We might as well be machines. Programmed to do what we're told. You have hope. More than you think. The fact that you were standing here, the first organic ever, proves it. But it also proves my solution won't work anymore. So now what? We find a new solution. Why are you telling me this? Why help me? You have altered the variables. What do you mean? The crucible changed me, created new possibilities, but I can't make them happen. If there is to be a new solution, you must act. It is now in your power to destroy us. Others will be destroyed as well. The Crucible will not discriminate. All synthetics will be targeted. Even you are partly synthetic. But the Reapers will be destroyed? Yes, but the peace won't last. Soon, your children will create synthetics, and then the chaos will come back. There has to be another way. There is. You could instead use the energy of the Crucible to seize control of the Reapers. So... The elusive man was right after all. Yes, but he could never have taken control. Because we already controlled him. But I can. You will die. You will control us, but you will lose everything you have. But the Reapers will obey me? Yes. We will be yours to control and direct as you see fit. Hmm. There is another solution. Synthesis. And that is? Add your energy to the Crucibles. The chain reaction will combine all synthetic and organic life into a new framework. A new DNA. I... don't know. Why not? Synthetics are already part of you. Can you imagine your life without them? And there will be peace? The, the cycle will end. The Reapers will cease their harvest. And the civilizations preserved in their forms will be connected to all of us. Synthesis is the final evolution of all life. The paths are open, but you have to choose. Beleza, galera, aqui a gente começa a falar o Shepard. Depois desse longo papo, a gente vai avançar. Temos aí caminho azul, se eu, me, se eu não me engano é para controlar Reapers, caminho vermelho para destruição. Vou fazer os dois caminhos, tá? Vou fazer os dois caminhos aí pra gente poder entender. Engage and get the hell out of here. 
The war is over. The Reapers have been defeated. Against all odds, and in the face of the greatest threat this galaxy has ever known, we survived. We suffered many losses. The relays are severely damaged, but we won. This victory belongs to each of us, every man, woman, and child, every civilization, on every world. Now, as we take our first steps toward restoring what we lost, we must remember what it took to win. This wasn't a victory by a single fleet, a single army, or even a single species. If this war has taught us anything, it is that we are at our strongest when we work together. And if we can put down our grievances long enough to stop something as powerful as the Reapers, imagine what we can achieve now that they are defeated. It will take time, but we can rebuild everything that was destroyed. Our homes, our worlds, our fleets and defenses, all of this and more. Together, we can build a future greater than any one of us could imagine. A future paid for by the sacrifices of those who fought and died alongside us. A future that many will never see. And while we still have many challenges ahead of us, we can face them together. And we will honor those who died to give us that future. Beleza, galera, finalizamos aí mais um projeto aqui no canal, a gente finaliza aí um jogaço, Mass Effect 3. A gente resolveu ir pelo caminho do Paragon, a gente salvou a humanidade, e o Shepard aparentemente tinha morrido, né? Mas nesse finalzinho aí a gente vê uma respiração, desejando também, né? E mostrando a gente que o Shepard tá vivo. Então a gente salvou toda a galáxia, finalizamos bem. Esse, esse projeto aí. Eu agradeço de coração a ajuda de vocês com like, compartilhamento, inscrição. Sejam todos muito bem-vindos aqui. Eu vou deixar vocês agora com crédito de Mass Effect 3. Mas no final dos créditos eu vou estar tá postando aí o outro caminho. Né? A gente indo lá 
é, a ponto de controlar o Reaper, beleza? Vou deixar vocês aí com os créditos, a música maneira tocando no fundo. E do finalzinho eu coloco então é, o outro caminho. Lembrando que na descrição do vídeo tem sempre a descrição do jogo, as nossas páginas da rede social, beleza? Eu agradeço aí de coração, fiquem com Deus e até a próxima. Did that all really happen? Yes, but some of the details have been lost in time. It all happened so very long ago. When can I go to the stars? One day, my sweet. What will be there? Anything you can imagine. Our galaxy has billions of stars. Each of those stars could have many worlds. Every world could be home to a different form of life. And every life is a special story of its own. Tell me another story about the shepherd. It's getting late, but okay. One more story.
Disengage and get the hell out of here. Jeff, we need to go.
infinite, immortal. The man I was used these words. But only now do I truly understand them. And only now do I understand the full extent of his sacrifice. Through his death, I was created. Through my birth, his thoughts were freed. They guide me now. Give me reason. Direction. Just as he gave direction to the ones who followed him. The ones who helped him achieve his purpose. Now, my purpose. To give the many hope for a future. To ensure that all have a voice in their future. The man I was knew that he could only achieve this by becoming something greater. There is power in control. There is wisdom in harnessing the strengths of your enemy. I will rebuild what the many have lost. I will create a future with limitless possibilities. I will protect and sustain. I will act as guardian for the many. And throughout it all, I will never forget. I will remember the ones who sacrificed themselves. So that the many could survive. And I will watch over the ones who live on. Those who carry the memory of the man I once was. The man who gave up his life to become the one who could save the many.
disengage and head to the rendezvous point. I repeat, disengage and get the hell out of here. Jeff, we need to go.
I am alive. All of us, synthetic and organic, have been changed. The war is over, and the Reapers are helping to rebuild. Where once they threatened us with extinction, they now bring us the collective knowledge of the cultures that came before. As a galaxy, we can now live the lives we have wished for. Taking our first steps into a new and wonderful future where organics and synthetics can coexist peacefully. With peace across the galaxy and with unlimited access to knowledge, to recover the greatness that was lost. and surpass it. We will reclaim our worlds and the stars as the line between synthetic and organic disappears. We may transcend mortality itself to reach a level of existence I cannot even imagine. And we will remember that this chance for a new life did not come without cost. No matter how far we advance, we will remember the sacrifices of those who made it possible. And we will remember Shepard. Because of him, I am alive. And I am not alone.